Hi again. In this particular video I'm going to talk a little bit about the content inserter feature of SEO Content Machine. Basically the content inserter is a great way to make your content look more natural and to increase its uniqueness as well. Content inserter as the name suggests can only be used if you have prepared your content beforehand. If you haven't, then you need to build the whole articles using the article creator. But for now, I'm going to focus on content inserter. So the first thing we see once we open this window is the general article tab of the content inserter. Here you enter the keywords for which uh, you're going to scrape additional uh, images and videos which you will insert in your articles so if you are if you have prepared articles on payday loans then it's only logical that those exact words are going to be the ones to scrape images for you can also spin your content if you'd like to if you only have prepared a non-spin tax version of it and here you can specify the folder well where the output will go to next we need to select the sources and they have to be local sources meaning that uh, you have to have prepared the articles beforehand and I have prepared three articles the ones that I scraped using the article downloader beforehand so now uh, if I want to I can insert additional links to this article. I wouldn't recommend that you do that uh, with this feature because you're going to insert links in a way that is not natural at all. You just have uh, keywords popping out in the middle of sentences basically in places that make no sense which will make your content look a bit more spammy and in the end it might get you banned. So it's not a good idea always always insert your links manually for a natural looking article however you can easily insert images in an automated way and still and make the article even more natural although you're doing automated work here you specify the your source from where to scrape images and you can even set the alt tags for each image they can be keyword rich alt tags Personally, I would suggest that you use suggested keywords, which means that the alt tags will be those three keywords as well as any keywords that are associated with them by Google Suggest, which is a really great way to diversify your alt tags while keeping the keyword density up. So uh, the image size, basically a personal preference. Personally, I would change it just a bit uh, just to make it more unique because if it's the default size of 250 then you can bet that a lot of people will be using 250 as their image size and that might prove to be a flag for automated content since SEO Content Machine is probably one of the most popular pieces of software in this niche. So uh, personally, I prefer to have from 0 to 2 images to make it more random and from 0 to 1 videos the video size in my opinion should be 360 since that's the standard size of a YouTube video and if you set it to anything different from 360 or 480 if you'd like but it will get too big in my opinion so 360 is probably okay so if you set it to 360 it's going to be just fine in my opinion and I think this is everything that you need you can of course turn off spinning and I'm going to turn it off just to make sure that we see the formatting of the images and the videos and now I run this task and now the task is complete and as you see here we see the original article and in random places we have the spin tax output of different images from which only one will be selected each time and as you see different images are have different styling 
which makes the footprint non-existent so you are safe to use this feature the alternate tax uh, is also in spin tax format as you see we have quite a few suggested keywords and here is the video spin tax in the end basically you have the default width and height and for each instance of this article you will actually go to a different video so now if that was your uh, manually written spin tax, spin tax ready article you can just pass it through this feature which is called content inserter and you have the same article with a variety of images inserted and videos which will make it even more unique than it is in the current moment which will enable you to use it more times and it will also make it much more natural in the eyes of anyone who is reading it. I hope this video was useful for you. Thanks for watching.